Yo, back with another one. Listen, um, we got P Diddy and Cassie. If you guys do not know who P Diddy is, go and do some research. Cassie is the long time wife of P Diddy. Um, P Diddy is a long time hip hop mogul. Um, you know, like some people might say he's a genius. Some people might say he's a, he's a legend. But let me tell you one thing: he has made a lot of money doing what he's doing. But some say, you know, his acts might be catching up to him. So Cassie, the longtime wife, files a $30 million lawsuit against P. Diddy, claiming that for years he abused her physically. And not just that, but sexually, he will actually pay prostitutes, especially guys with a big stick, to have a sexual intercourse with his wife while he watched and or masturbate. Um, I don't know how true this is, but this shit is sick, bro. What do you guys gonna think about this, right? Um, well, no further ado, let's get back into it. She, she also accused, she also accused him of, um, of um, him forcing him of sexual abuse, where he, P. Diddy, would force himself on Cassie. And um, P. Diddy responds with a strong defense, calling Cassie's claim a straight up money grab. His attorney stated Mr. Combs vehemently denies these offensive and outrageous allegations. For the past six months, Mr. Combs has subjected to Ms. Vanura's persistence demand of $30 million. So the, basically this um, court is saying that for the, par for the past few months, Cassie has tried to get out to PDD saying, hey, listen, I want $30 million or I'm going to go ahead and sue you, right, for this, this, and this. And PDD been trying to play it off, you know. When you have money, you can do a lot of shit and think things are not gonna catch up to you. Um, so short story short, short story short, Cassie filed a thirty million dollar lawsuit. Uh, this lawsuit seems to be painting a lot of negative image around P Diddy and his crew and his family. But um, I'm just here to record. I'm just here to give you guys the news as it is, and we're not further ado. So P Diddy's legal team also claimed that Cassie. Um, also threatened of writing a damaging book about the relationship, which was unequivocally rejected as a blunted blackmail, despite withdrawing her initial threat. So, with this back and forth, Cassie's attorney replied, uh, his name was Douglas, he claims that Mr. Combs or Diddy offered Ms. Vanera, which is Cassie, eight figures to silence her and prevent the filing of the lawsuit. Mr. Comb, Mr. Comb, Daddy, and Miss Cassie Venure reached a settlement in a lawsuit despite the comments made by, by both Miss Venera and Mr. Comb's attorney. Now, the settlement, for you guys who do not know, was for the 30 million which she threatened to sue him for. So he just agreed to pay, to pay, to pay her the 30 million instead of going forth with the lawsuit. I guess there's some things in the chicken coop that is trying to be hidden, right? And um, I mean, how true is all this? We're not gonna know because she has accepted the offer. I guess she was doing this for some money grab after all. Or maybe she liked, or maybe there's actually some truth to it. You know, when, you, when you're in Hollywood and, you know, rich people are sick, you know? They do a lot of, do a lot of weird stuff, a lot of weird parties, orgy and stuff like that. When you're used to that, and you just wake up in the morning and say, I wanna I wanna take a shower and you can call someone to come shower you. I wanna work out and you can call a guy that can come fuck your wife for you and stuff like that. You know you can see how how you can think life life works a certain type of way, right? Um but I guess this is the world we're living in today. Can are you really gonna blame her? You know, 